But today's July 23rd, and we have a very interesting quote, and there's not a whole lot to say about it because it's so self-evident. And the quote today is entitled, We're Never Alone. We are never without association because we always associate with ourselves. We should be good association for ourselves. So have you ever said, I need association? And it's funny, of course we all need association, we all benefit from association. It's a fun fundamental principle of Krishna consciousness. It's recommended, but who do we associate with the most? Ourselves. Isn't that interesting? So sometimes we say, I really need association, I desperately need association. And that's, in a sense, Another way of saying, I've been associating with myself and I have to get away from myself because myself is such bad association, I desperately need some good association to get away from this bad association. Isn't that funny? If you, if you put it in that context, in a sense that's what we're saying. And of course, we're associating with our mind, so the mind can sometimes be crazy. So. When we're saying, I need association desperately, we're, in another sense, we're saying, my mind is driving me crazy. It's thinking about everything but Krishna. And I don't like being with myself. I don't like being alone because when I'm with myself alone, maybe I'm not Krishna conscious. Now, if you like being alone and you feel Krishna conscious, that's really good because then you are good association for yourself. So. If you're hearing ch and chanting nicely, if you're, you have the proper, proper service mood, etc., then you're good association for yourself. And we should be good association. It's not meant to replace other association. It doesn't mean, I'm not saying you don't need association, but generally we don't think about being good association for ourselves. So if you're a good devotee, if you try to be a good devotee, then you're good association for yourself and you're always with yourself, you always have good association, and you'll always be happy in Krishna consciousness with this good association you have. And since we are associating with ourselves all the time, we should be good association for ourselves, don't you think? And so, it's amazing how Krishna consciousness works because you're associating with yourself, and yourself who is Krishna conscious becomes Krishna conscious association. Now I know that's very simple and obvious, but the reason I'm talking about it is because we don't talk about this. We always talk about association with someone else. So be good association for yourself. Like yourself, you'll always be with the person you like. You'll always be happy. Hare Krishna.